so kumi kukura na oji asase no anta yakopon so obo so ni asase no ni tumi dosu anti wantumi akunu wa wa ha ya pasta sa ya pasta wu se adam na ma si wu ye a o sha fijim na papa wei asuma nko ofo so maji asase no the aggrieved members of kingdom of god church and occupants of these makeshift structures at clagon within the tema west municipality say they bought the land first over 15 years ago they explained that a mega church breaking yoke is claiming ownership of the land destroying their properties intimidating and threatening to eject them from the land the breaking yoke church also came in saying that the land they have bought the land from the knee clan that's club or chief so we should vacate on the land and later he sent the land guard boys some call uh, sankara and if you find his boy, they could come and demolish our church on Wednesday. When we wake up, we went to report at the Clagon police station. The matter was called. On the next day, we haven't finished the matter. And then they sent another boys. They should come and demolish all the church. And those people who came and demolished the this thing, none have not been arrested. And we are waiting. Later, he himself confirmed at the police station that he sent the landlord, Sankara, to find his boys to come and demolish him. And police people, did not arrest anyone in any person. Papa, we are high. On your mind, you mean na? You mean no? I go for karma, be so about to her. Karma, na na, you do about posa. On my end, na. Papa, we are high, sir. You see, you die, you mean na? Because you are so so about to be queen. You are so so about to have karma, be high. So what? What talk about a police for you now? Or so what talk, baby? The contested land, though, forms part of the Sakumono wetland and thus makes claims by both parties null and void. So would you agree if government steps in and says that indeed this whole place belongs to wildlife, so you both should vacate? We don't have a problem. We don't have a problem because that was... Yes, you may have nothing to lose because your church is small and his is huge, so you are okay because you wouldn't have much to lose. It's not that way, you know, because since you, if you know the land does not belong to you, why should you be claiming ownership over it? If Nadmo is the only person who can demolish, and you you go in and high unbelievers as a pastor, go and high unbelievers to come and demolish your fellow church, it's abnormal. Seriously, it's abnormal. Government has to do something about this. Efforts to speak with head pastor of Breaking Yoke Church proved futile. The members of the Kingdom of God Church, though, are appealing for government immediate intervention. Metro News shall follow up and keep you updated from Klagong. This is Gabriel Ni Obodai Togwa Ashon reporting for Metro News.